do you think that there's almost like more success and more drive in terms of like, you know, personality and people personalizing stuff with social media rather than, um, you know, some people when they when they make a project, they might think, OK, I want to create like a, a, a company account or an account that that's, um, you know, yeah. more kind of corporate. Do you think that the way to go on, on, on social media, if people have a product, if they've got something potential that they, they want to give out, it, it's almost better to like personalize it in a way that that that, you know, gives it to the people in a more definitely. personal approach? Yeah, definitely. I mean, all business is based upon relationships. If you mm. cannot establish a relationship with your customers or clients or whatever it is, there's not there's not going to be a transaction. And yeah. This is what I think people m m misunderstand. And I'm not saying that to be personal, you need to put yourself out there. You maybe you're camera shy. You don't have to do it. It's yeah. all about this relating this relatable content to your uh, target group, to your audience, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. having an audience and knowing okay, this this is what they want. The bunch of things on social media, you know. Uh, like corporate or business account, which is very like engaging. I, I always talk about this term. I think it was actually Walt Disney. He, he, he started with it, like education, uh, edutainment, edutainment, like education. Edutainment. Yeah, edutainment, like education and entertainment, and mm. merge these two things. Learning is something we people do uh, in action, in motion, in in. Like if we are stimulated or entertained, we are much likely to learn things. That's why, yeah. you know, you can, you, it's very hard to sit through a very boring lecture, but you can look at the documentaries that are three hours long and you're like, well, what, what happened with time? Right. Mm -hmm. Um, so I think uh, this social media is a big thing. Like, I think you can do a whole podcast about it. I would say like this, be very careful going to, into social media, being a consumer. Yeah. Be very, mm. very careful. If you're going to be a consumer, like uh, uh, everything about social media, if you're a Muslim, obviously, is going to put you through haram things. It mm. makes you see haram things, wh whether you like it or not. So this is a very important thing. I never, I never tell people or encourage them to get social media. If you have a good life without social media, keep it like that. Because there's a lot of anxiety, a lot of things, a lot of bad things on social media. Now, if you yeah. want to be a producer, in social media, making content, a content creator, do it, but make sure you have a law first in your head. Mm. Don't make, don't do it for the fame. Well, like, yeah. you know, fame is nothing. I have like 135,000 on Instagram and you know, things get much, much more complicated when you got so many eyes on you, especially yeah. in your intentions and in your mental health. Sure.